Arm Waxing When beginning hair removal on the arms, remember to look carefully at the direction of hair growth and remove in sections as wide as the large muslin strips. The lower arm usually has more hair and grows in a downward direction. Generally, there is less hair on the upper arm and it also grows in a downward direction. After you sanitize your hands with GG Hand Sanitizer, test the temperature of the wax on the inside of your wrist. Next, fully cleanse the arm with GG Pre-Hon Pre-Appellation Cleanser and pat thoroughly dry. Next, dust a thin layer of GG Pre-Appellation Powder. We suggest using GG Ozoline Wax. GG Ozoline Wax has a thin consistency and spreads a lighter film of wax on the arm hair. It's great for removing fine to medium hair and the Ozoline oil in the formula provides soothing properties. Use a GG Large AccuEdge applicator at a 45 degree angle and apply the wax in large sections as wide as the large muslin strips. Start from the elbow and working towards the wrist. Place Gigi's large muslin epilating strip over the wax and firmly rub three times in the direction of the hair growth. In one quick motion, hold skin taut and remove strip in the opposite direction of hair growth parallel to the skin. Firmly apply pressure with your palm against the skin for a few seconds. This helps reduce sensitivity to the area. Repeat the process down to the wrist. For full arm hair removal, continue the application from the shoulder to the elbow. Use a GG Large AccuEdge applicator at a 45 degree angle and apply the wax in large sections as wide as the large muslin strips. Starting from the shoulder and work towards the elbow. Place GG's Large Muslin Epilating Strip over the wax and firmly rub three times in the direction of the hair growth. In one quick motion, hold skin taut and remove strip in the opposite direction of hair growth parallel to the skin. Firmly apply pressure with your palm against the skin for a few seconds. This helps reduce sensitivity to the area. Repeat the process down to the elbow. After all hair removal is completed, apply GG Wax Off and if necessary, after wax cooling gel. Always apply GG Slow Grow and suggest to your client that they continue to receive the benefit by taking home GG Keep It Bare for body and legs. Let's review arm hair removal service. Remember to sanitize your hands with GG Hand Sanitizer. Check the temperature of the wax by applying a small amount to the inside of your wrist. Identify the direction of hair growth. Apply GG Pre-Hon Pre-Epilation Cleanser and Pre-Epilation Powder. These two steps are essential to the hair removal technique. Always start at the elbow applying the wax at a 45 degree angle in sections as wide as the muslin strips. Remember to firmly rub three times and remove the strips in the opposite direction of the hair growth parallel to the skin. The average charge for a full arm service is $30. With only one client per day, five days per week, you will generate an extra income of $7,800 per year. Leg Waxing Use GG Hand Sanitizer before touching your client's skin. Test the temperature of the wax by placing a small amount on the inside of your wrist. Once a comfortable temperature has been established, you can begin your waxing service. The first step in the leg hair removal procedure is to see how much hair there is to be removed and the direction of the hair growth. Next, cleanse the area to be waxed with GG Pre-Hon Pre-Epilation Cleanser and pat thoroughly dry. Use GG Pre-Epilation Powder on entire area to be waxed. Using GG Large AccuEdge Applicators, apply all-purpose honey at a 45-degree angle in long strokes from the knees towards the ankles in the direction of the hair growth, one section at a time. GG All-Purpose Honey has a light, spreadable consistency, making it very easy to work with. The special blend makes all-purpose honey the most comfortable wax for your client. 
Place a GG large muslin epilating strip over the wax and rub three times in the direction of the hair growth. In one quick motion, hold skin taut and remove strip in the opposite direction of hair growth parallel to the skin. Firmly apply pressure with your palm against the skin for a few seconds. This helps reduce sensitivity to the area. Remember, never apply wax over an area previously waxed. Reapplying wax to an area that has just been waxed can become bruised. Continue these application steps throughout the lower leg area. The knee is bent to create a firm surface and allow the hair to stand away from the skin. Gigi All Purpose Honey is next applied to the knee in small sections, one section at a time, and removed in the opposite direction of the hair growth with GG small muslin epilating strips and firm pressure is applied to calm the skin. The hair on the upper leg is removed in the same way. Long strokes of all-purpose honey at a 45 degree angle are placed from the hip towards the knee. The large muslin strips are placed over the wax and rubbed three times in the same direction of the hair growth and quickly removed in the opposite direction of the hair growth parallel to the skin. Firm pressure is applied with the palm of your hands to calm the skin. After all hair removal has taken place, apply GG Wax Off to the entire leg. This product will immediately smooth and remove any sticky residue. Lastly, apply GG Slow Grow to inhibit hair growth for a longer period of time and offer GG Keep It Bare for body and legs as a retail item. Let's review the full leg waxing service. Remember to use GG hand sanitizer before beginning any hair removal services. The temperature of the wax always needs to be checked by testing a small amount inside of your wrist. The two most important preliminary steps in waxing are, one, cleanse the skin with GG Prehon Pre-Epilation Cleanser, and two, apply GG Pre-Epilation Powder. The full leg hair removal begins with the lower leg. Individual sections are applied at a 45 degree angle in the direction of the hair growth. Epilating strips are applied and secured by rubbing the hand downward on the strip three times and quickly removing the strip in the opposite direction of the hair growth parallel to the skin. Apply pressure to the freshly waxed area with the palm of your hand to reduce sensitivity. The upper leg is completed in the same way. The knee is bent and small sections are applied and removed. Never reapply wax to an area that has just been waxed. Pulling wax and epilating strip off hair-free skin can cause damage to the skin. After all hair is removed, apply GG Wax Off to remove any lingering sticky residue that may be left on the skin. If a client has very sensitive skin, it might be necessary to follow up with an application of GG Skin Calming Lotion. Should the client experience redness, it is recommended to follow up with an application of GG Post Wax Cooling Gel. Finally, apply GG Slow Grow to help inhibit hair growth for an extended period of time and make sure the client takes a bottle of GG Keep It Bare for Body and Legs home to use daily after showering. The average charge for a full leg service is $85. With only one client per day, five days per week, you will generate an extra income of $22,100 per year. Brow Waxing Sanitize your hands with GG Hand Sanitizer. Next, check the temperature of wax on the inside of your wrist to make sure it is not too hot. Place the petite muslin strip over the wax area and remove the muslin strip. Next, by placing Gigi's fine applicator from the inner corner of the eye to the brow, you can identify the hair to be removed between the brows. By placing the fine applicator from the outer corner of the eye to the brow, you can see where you want the brow to end. Check the direction of hair growth in the brow. Determine how much hair to remove beneath the brow line. When using wax near the eye area, always instruct your client to keep their eyes closed. 
Cleanse with GG Pre Han Pre Appellation Cleanser and pat thoroughly with a dry tissue. Dust a thin layer of GG Pre Appellation Powder. Next, using the fine applicator at a 45 degree angle, apply GG Facial Honey beneath the brow line. Next, apply a thin layer of GG Facial Honey in the center area between the brows in the direction of the hair growth. Immediately place a GG Petite Muslin Strip over the wax and firmly rub the strip in the direction of the hair growth. Hold the skin taut and in one quick motion pull the strip off parallel to the skin in the opposite direction of the hair growth. Next, place the petite muslin strip over the wax area. Rub three times in the direction of hair growth. Hold skin taut and remove the muslin strip parallel to the skin in the opposite direction of hair growth in one quick motion. Apply firm pressure with your fingers. Repeat on the other eyebrow. Remember, do not wax over an area that has already been waxed because the skin may become bruised. Use GG pointed tweezers to quickly remove any tiny hairs left behind. After all hair removal has taken place, apply GG Wax Off to the entire waxed area. This product will immediately smooth and remove any sticky residue. Should your client experience redness, apply GG Post Wax Concealer to conceal and protect your client's skin. The average charge for eyebrow waxing is $14. With only three clients per day, five days per week, you will generate an extra income of $10,920 per year. To increase retail profits, we suggest to upsell GG hair removal strips for the face as a take-home product for your client to maintain well-groomed brows in between salon visits. Underarm Waxing be sure to sanitize your hands with GG Hand Sanitizer and always check the temperature of the wax by testing it inside your wrist. Have your client extend her arm over her head and then tuck her hand under her head. Your client can assist by pulling the skin taut with the other hand. Many times the hair separates from the center, growing upward and downward. Cleanse with GG Pre Han Pre Appellation Cleanser. Make sure that the area is dry before dusting a thin layer of GG pre appellation powder. At a 45 degree angle, apply a small amount of GG dark honey to the hair growing in the upward direction and place GG's large muslin epilating strip over the wax. Firmly rub three times in the direction of the hair growth. In one quick motion, Hold skin taut and remove strip in the opposite direction of hair growth, parallel to the skin. Firmly apply pressure with your fingers to calm the skin. Again, at a 45 degree angle, apply the wax to the hair growing in the downward direction and place a large muslin strip over it. Rub three times in the direction of hair growth. With one quick motion, hold skin taut and remove the strip in the opposite direction of hair growth, parallel to the skin. With your fingers, firmly apply pressure. GG Wax Off is essential to the service, as well as GG After Wax Cooling Gel. Apply GG Slow Grow to inhibit the regrowth of hair for a longer period of time. Finish the service with an application of GG Pre Appellation Powder to soothe and comfort the waxed area. Also, warn your client not to apply deodorant right away, as most deodorants contain ingredients that can irritate this area. Let's review the underarm hair removal procedure. Before starting the service, use GG hand sanitizer. Always use the two preliminary steps before waxing, pre hon and pre epilation powder. The removal step will be determined by the direction of the growth pattern of the underarm hair. Wax off and after wax cooling gel are very important to this service. 
We suggest that the area be powdered with pre-epilation powder after all lotions are applied and that the client is informed not to use deodorant right after the service. The average charge for an underarm service is $15. With two clients per day, five days per week, you will generate an extra income of $7,800 per year. To increase retail profits, we suggest to upsell Gigi Keep It Bare for body and legs as a take-home product for your client to use at home every day after showering. Lip Waxing Lip Waxing is simple and quick. Sanitize your hands with Gigi Hand Sanitizer. Next, check the temperature of wax on the inside of your wrist. Place the petite muslin strip over the wax area and remove the muslin strip. Next, check the direction of hair growth. Usually, the hair grows outward from the center of the lip to the corner. It grows in a downward direction towards the corner of the mouth. Next, cleanse with Gigi Prehon Pre-Epilation Cleanser and pat thoroughly with a dry tissue. Dust a thin layer of Gigi Pre-Epilation Powder. Using a Gigi Small AccuEdge Applicator, apply a thin line of Gigi Facial Honey at a 45 degree angle from the center of the lip across the top of the lip. Use a Gigi Small Muslin Epilating Strip and rub three times in the direction of hair growth. In one quick motion, hold the skin taut and remove strip in the opposite direction of hair growth parallel to the skin. Apply firm pressure with your fingers to calm the skin. Next, at a 45 degree angle and using a small amount of Gigi Facial Honey on the remaining hair on the upper lip, apply in a downward motion towards the corner of the mouth. Place the small muslin over the wax and rub three times in the direction of the hair growth. In one quick motion, hold skin taut and remove in an upward movement parallel to the skin. Firmly apply pressure with your fingers. Repeat on the other side. Apply Gigi Wax Off to remove any sticky wax filling. Apply Gigi Post Wax Concealer to conceal redness. Makeup can be applied right after Gigi Post Wax Concealer as well. Let's review facial hair removal services. Identify the direction of hair growth. Remember to sanitize the hands with Gigi Hand Sanitizer. Check the temperature of the wax by applying a small amount to the inside of your wrist. Apply Gigi Prehon Pre-Epilation Cleanser and Pre-Epilation Powder. Keep in mind that waxing is done in sections. Remember to firmly rub three times, hold skin taut, and remove the strips in the opposite direction of the hair growth parallel to the skin. The average charge for upper lip waxing is $10. With only four clients per day, five days per week, you will generate an extra income of $10,400 per year. Bikini Waxing The Bikini Hair Removal Service requires removal of hair on the bikini line and inside the leg. The client should be given a Gigi disposable panty. We suggest using Gigi cream wax designed for sensitive areas. All of Gigi's cream waxes are recommended to use with Gigi cloth epilating strips. Before starting the service, sanitize your hands with Gigi hand sanitizer. Test the temperature of the wax by placing a small amount on the inside of your wrist. Once a comfortable temperature has been established, you can begin waxing your client. It is important that the client relax the legs into the bikini waxing position. Place the client in position number one. The legs are slightly spread apart with one leg slightly bent at the knee and the foot resting against the other leg. Apply Gigi Prehon Pre-Epilation Cleanser to the bikini line area and the area on the high inner thigh. Next, dust a thin layer of Gigi Pre-Epilation Powder. 
GG Cream Wax is applied in a 45 degree angle in a downward movement in the same direction of hair growth. Your client may assist in holding back the disposable panty and pulling the skin taut. Quickly place cloth strip over the wax and rub three times in the direction of hair growth. And remove the cloth strip in the opposite direction of hair growth parallel to the skin. Firmly apply pressure with your fingers or the palm of your hands to calm the skin. Place the client in position number two. The leg is bent up to the chest and the client grips the leg just below the knee. This position will allow hair removal in the high inner thigh bikini line area. GG Cream Wax is applied in a 45 degree angle in a downward movement in the same direction of hair growth. Quickly place cloth strip over the wax and rub three times in the direction of hair growth and remove the cloth strip in the opposite direction of hair growth parallel to the skin. Firmly apply pressure with your fingers or the palm of your hands to calm the skin. After all hair is removed, apply GG Wax Off to ensure all wax residue is removed. Almost every client is somewhat sensitive after a bikini epilating service. So it's recommended to apply GG Bikini Soothing Cream to relieve any irritation. Finish with GG Slow Grow to inhibit hair growth. And make sure your client takes home a bottle of GG Keep It Bare for body and legs. Let's review the Bikini Hair Removal Service. GG has the most gentle cream wax designed specifically for sensitive areas. GG Cream Wax is excellent for bikini hair removal. Remember to test the temperature of the wax and to sanitize your hands with GG Hand Sanitizer. Offer your client one of Gigi's disposable panties. The client must relax into the bikini hair removal positions. In position number one, the legs are slightly spread apart with one leg slightly bent at the knee and the foot resting against the other leg to remove the hair in front of the panty line. In position two, the leg is bent up to the chest and the client grips the leg just below the knee to remove the hair in the high inner thigh. The two most important preliminary steps of GG waxing are, one, cleanse the skin with GG Prehon Pre-Epilation Cleanser, and two, apply GG Pre-Epilation Powder. Apply wax in a 45 degree angle in individual sections in the direction of the hair growth. Cloth strips are applied and secured by rubbing the hand downward on the strip and quickly removing the strip in the opposite direction of the hair growth parallel to the skin. Ensure that all sticky wax residue is removed with GG Wax Off. Use GG Bikini Soothing Cream to relieve any irritation. Last, apply GG Slow Grow to inhibit the regrowth of the hair. Remember that you can retail GG Keep It Bare for body and legs for your client to use at home daily after showering. The average charge for a bikini waxing service is $30. With only two clients per day, five days per week, you will generate an extra income of $15,600 per year.